While Singapore is usually safe, alleged knife assaults may crop up from time to time to shake us from this impression. The latest one involved a woman who was reportedly chased by a man with a knife in Geelang. She was thankfully saved by another man who aimed a flying kick at her would-be assailant, an eyewitness said. However, her saviour ended up sustaining injuries of his own. The violent incident took place at 8.15pm on Sunday, November 12, reported Shin Min Daily News. According to an eyewitness named Lee Kuei, transliterated from Mandarin, he saw the whole thing while he was withdrawing cash from an ATM nearby. The 49-year-old electrician told the paper that he saw a woman in a black and white striped dress screaming and running out from Lorong 25 Geelang. She was being chased by a man holding a knife. Which was a scary sight, Mr. Lee said. Alarmingly, the man managed to catch up to the woman by the roadside in front of the ATM, grabbing her by her long hair with one hand. He raised his knife and was about to strike when a saviour emerged at that critical moment. Another man ran up and aimed a flying kick at the bald man's shoulder, causing him to lose his balance. The woman took the opportunity to escape. The good Samaritan then engaged in a scuffle with the bald man, trying to subdue him. Unfortunately, during the struggle, the saviour was stabbed in his right abdomen. This caused him to bleed out all over the ground. Fortunately, another man across the street, who was wearing red, saw what was happening and ran over to help subdue the bald man. The two of them grabbed his arms and managed to take away the weapon. At this point, the saviour was bleeding profusely, but told his friends that he was fine. In response to queries from Shin Min, the police said a 32-year-old man had been arrested for voluntarily causing hurt with a dangerous weapon. He was seen handcuffed and sitting cross-legged by the road next to several police officers. Another man, age 46, was injured. The Singapore Civil Defence Force SCDF said he was taken to Tan Tok Sung Hospital. The 32-year-old man, who suffered slight injuries, declined to be taken to hospital. The case is currently under investigation. According to Shin Min, the bald man and the woman were housemates who lived in different rooms. The man had courted the woman, but she considered this to be harassment. This led to their relationship souring and the violent incident. The man who saved her is also known to the woman, who is a friend. According to Mr. Lee, the eyewitness, after the bald man was subdued, he turned to the 46-year-old and said, Brother, my life is over. He also told him that he shouldn't have tried to protect her. Hopefully, the good Samaritan's injuries aren't serious and he recovers quickly.